Hey there, it's Daniel from thegoodapps.com where you can get free Google Docs templates and guides. Let's go get and then edit a Google Sheets template. This time we are getting and then editing a free Google Sheets template, which is the template from any other source except those common ones on Google Sheets and except making one on your own. First up, let's quickly sign into Google account. We're going to google.com and entering Google homepage. Now, to check that you are signed in, drag the mouse to the top right corner of the window. And here, if you see your profile picture or an icon with a person, if you don't have it, means that you are signed in. If not, you will have such a button suggesting to sign in. So, we press it. And in here, we enter either our email address or a phone number linked to the account. I'm going with email. The goo docs at gmail.com. Then I press next down here. And on the next page, I enter my password. And so are you. Then pressing next over here. And getting redirected back to the Google homepage. But now I am signed into my Google account. And you can always check that by looking at the top right corner here. And if there's either your profile picture or an icon with a person, that means you are signed in. Now we go to the website with Google Sheets templates. Or searching it in Google from right here. The Goo Docs free templates. And enter. Now let's scroll down and skip the advertisements. And here's the website, thegoodax.com, that we press on and enter its homepage. Now let's get ourselves something. Here we access the drop down at the top of the page menu by dragging the mouse cursor to it. In the menu, we drag the mouse to the other column and press in sheets below it. On this page, there's basically thousands of different Google Sheets templates, all free for you. So pick whichever you like and use it absolutely free of charge. Now let's get some. I'm picking a basic one, like this weekly employee timesheet. Click on the image or its headline. On this next page on the left, you can preview the template before editing it and get it if you like it. For that, next to the image, we locate such a window and press in the Edit Template button. Now this is a review of what you are about to get and selection of the size, where we have a single option, the US letter, which is measured 8.5 by 11 inches. Selecting it and on the next page, we wait till the download starts which will be done automatically. And on the next window, Google Sheets will ask you if you want to copy the template to your Google Drive. So yes, to use it, press Make a copy. Wait a bit, and it will open in front of you as a common Google Sheets document. But it is now yours. Locate it on your Google Drive, you can edit it, and all changes will be automatically saved on your drive. Now let's do something with it. We'll go left to right. First, let's name our company by pressing on the cell twice, deleting the placeholder text and entering the company name, the Goo Ducks. And then, the similar way you continue filling the company information down here. Then, this whole template is made for tracking a single employee's working hours. And we certainly need to enter the employee's name. Now in this column, we press on a cell below the employee name and enter the hypothetical Jack Smith, whose supervisor is myself, Daniel Miller. Now let's do a few things related to the Google Sheets format specifically. The date over here. And this is the place where we come to the most awesome feature of Google Sheets templates. The fact they always come with working formulas. Unlike Google Docs and Slides, where it's all about the design, 
the data in certain cells is linked to the data in other cells. So, editing those specific values will make the dependent values change according to your edits. Let me show you that. Press in twice on the date field to open the calendar. Returning to the previous month with this little arrow on top right. And selecting the first day of the week that we're tracking. November 14th, let's say. Now, what happened if you have noticed? The month here just changed from December to November. And the days here refreshed as well. According to the November calendar. That's exactly because the month over here is dependent on the main date of the document. As this isn't just a text, but a formula. That we will open up with a double click on it. And see the formula. In which the values change according to this cell. You can know that due to the fact that it highlights the cell it is dependent from. But that's not all that it changed. The days in the graph over here have been updated according to the days of the selected week. Because if we change that to another day, you will see that it refreshes respectively. This is what's really nice about Google Sheets templates. Then it's working hours count. And their total number here and here by the column. Then the total number of working hours is multiplied by $18 rate per hour in the next cell and outputs the end result right here in the total to pay field. Meaning that when we, let's say, add 8 hours to one more working day, that will make the whole formula chain update according to the new inputs, which will count all hours in this column, multiply it by $18 and give you the total number. All this applies to all other cells in the table, as you can see by these values down here. And then here it counts the salary for the entire week, including the total of working days with all hours. And then also duplicates the number to the final field here. So as the total number of hours is copied from here, from the total hours count. Finishing it with signatures, and dates. As you just saw, Google Sheets templates provide not just a beautifully crafted table, but a truly practical tool to work with certain types of data, depending on your goals. This is what Google Sheets templates really mean. It is definitely easier to get a free template and paste your data into it than designing it all on your own from a scratch. Fortunately, there are lots of absolutely free templates on the goodax.com for you. Hundreds more guides and a lot of free Google Docs templates on the goodax.com following the link below the video. Like to help share our videos to more people and subscribe to see more guides. I hope we helped you. Thank you for watching.